Hello guys and welcome to K1 Repair Center. Today I'm going to show you if you got a problem with your iPod, iPad mini. In that case, I have iPad mini here. Screen is damaged. And we have ordered a new screen aftermarket one. And then you will plug, connect the new screen into the iPad mini. The Apple logo is turned on. And after this Apple logo disappeared, the iPad is on, but nothing show on the display. And I'm going to let show you what is the problem. Let me connect that one to show you what I mean. So disconnect the battery always before you are operating or connecting the screen in or out. So you can see it is Apple logo is there. It's loading, take a little bit while. So you see Apple logo is disappeared, but actually the iPad is on. I'm not sure if you are able going to hear what even I connected the charge into. I hope you can hear it. However, the iPad is on, but nothing on the display. So I'm going to tell you what is the problem. Right in this point, I need to say to John D. I don't want to say the surname, but Mr. John D. He helped me to figure it out. What was it problem? Firstly, thanks him to let me know. So, what you want to do from your old screen, this is a copy screen as well. From your old screen, you got the display flex underneath here. You want to just take it that one off and put it in the new one. This is the issue. So I have many, many years ago. We have the same issues and done it, but honestly, forgot about it. But thanks to John, he let me know yesterday and we figured it out. So you see, this is the, this is the flex, what we want to remove, this one here, take it off and transfer to the new iPad and it should everything work fine so let it do it that one okay bring it New screen back in. Some of the screen when it's coming, they are already in. But if not, just so you know what is the problem that you are going to transfer the display flex. Maybe it's just different name. I tell it's called display flex. However, to transfer that one to the Replacement screen to the new screen. So let it line it up. Come on. Oh my God. So. Okay. All right, so let a little bit clean it. Let the put the flex back in the nice position. It should be all. Yeah. So let it try it again, shall we? 
Don't forget to disconnect the battery every time when you connect and disconnect the screen. Okay, let's load it now. Voila, as you can see, it's working fine. So I hope this video helped. If any question, any comment, any help, Drop me comment. I try my best to help you. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Hopefully, see you in the next video. Thank you for watching. K1 Repair Center. Keep safe.